I am Robert Andrew Milliken. I was born in Illinois, USA on March 22nd, 1868, as the second son of my parents. I attended to Mark Okeda High School. After working for a short time as a court reporter, I entered Oberlin College in 1886. During my undergraduate course, my favorite subjects were Greek and mathematics. But after my graduation in 1891, I took for two years a teaching post in elementary physics. After I finished my school life, I did lots of experiments such as the all drop experiment, and I experimentally studied the escape of electrons from metal surfaces under strong electric fields. What's more, I studied orbits and curvatures or of cosmic particles. The alpha particle, high speed electrons, protons, neutrons, positrons, and V quantum in comets a cosmic rays are found. It has changed the idea that cosmic rays are photons in the past. The oil drop experiment is to make the oil, which has positive pro protons and negative electrons, to fall through a hole in a plate with negative charge, which, which will separate the negative charge from the protons. Now, the oil drop is positive, so it will repel from the positive charge plate. And we can control both amount charges. Because of this, we can watch how fast an atom moves, and we can calculate out how heavy an atom is, and how big the charge of an electron is by a microscope. Of this experiment, the uh, experiment is based on J.J. Thompson's, Thompson's experiment, which claims that an atom has two parts, protons and electrons. After I claim that we can calculate the mass of an electron by its charge, I wrote lots of books such as Science and Life, Evolution in Science and Religion, Science and the New Civilization. During World War I, I was Vice Chairman of the National Research Council, playing a major part in developing anti-submarine and meteorological devices. In 1921, I was appointed Director of the Norman Bridge Laboratory of Physics at the California Institute of Technology, Pasadena. I was also made chairman of the executive council of that institute. In 1946, I retired from this post. I have been president of the American Physical Society, vice president of the American Association for the Advancement of Science, and was an American member of the Amity of Intellectual Corporation of the League of Nations and the American representative at the International Congress of Physics. Known as the Soviet Congress at Brussels in, in 1921, I held honorary doctor's degree of some 25 universities and was a member of honorary member of many learned institutions in my country and abroad. I've been the recipient of the Comstock Prize of the National Academy of Science of the Edison model to, uh, of the American Institute of Electrical Engineers, of the Hugh Medal of the Royal Society of Great Britain, and of the Nobel Prize of uh, Physics. 1923, I was also made Commander of the Legion of Honor and received the Chinese Order of Jade.